of fact, as a matter of fact, I want to mention uh, one of our sponsors that actually every year they're, they, they're here, and that is the Can TV people. They usually come and record on Friday, but this time I asked them if they could do it on Saturday. So the Can TV in the back there, you could give them a hand for, because you know, if you miss the festival, you could always catch it on YouTube as part of the whole thing. So this, this particular event will be transmitted on Facebook, I mean, not Facebook, on YouTube uh, as part of the Can TV programming. It'll probably be out in about two or three weeks. So thanks to uh, Can TV for their efforts and their support. Since we are celebrating women's role in Latin jazz music, I would like to bring up a young lady who is going to introduce our next act. And she happens to be the person that's responsible for a lot of the stuff that's going on here. Uh, she's the program manager for the Jazz Institute of Chicago. I want to welcome Adriana Prieto. Let's give a hand to Adriana Prieto. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Bienvenidos al Treceavo Festival de Latin Jazz. Uh, welcome to the 13th Chicago Latin Jazz Festival. Um, since this is a festival that uh, shines a light on women roles, and of course we have several women-led bands, like the one I'm about to present, but also there are a lot of women here, and I would like to acknowledge them, like we have our volunteers, our staff, people in, produ in production, backstage and on stage. So can we have an applause for all the women who are right now here? Thank you, making this beautiful moment happen. Thank you. So, um, I am happy to introduce this duet of Nitya Martinez and Darwin Noguera. They, are, they have been longtime musical partners in Chicago. Darwin is a Nicaraguan-born pianist. You might remember him as a co-founder of the Chicago Afro-Latin Jazz Ensemble, and he has been active in both um, Chicago and New York scenes. Anithia is a Chicago-based vocalist. She, it, she has been the choral and musical theater director at Northside College Prep High School since 2004. <laughs> and she was also a member of the Chicago Afro-Latin Jazz Ensemble. So without further ado, please give a big round of applause to Anithia Martinez and Darwin Noguera. everybody. Some don't know how 
Thank you so much, everybody. Um, so my name is Nitya Martinez. I'm here with my brother in music um, and beloved Chicago jazz superstar, Darwin Nogueira. Um, I'm so thrilled to share the stage with Darwin tonight because ours is a partnership that began about 15 years ago. We've performed together in many capacities, most often in combos and big bands, but when this wonderful opportunity came um, to my uh, attention, thank you Jazz Institute for the invitation, by the way. Um, when this opportunity arose, uh, the show that I envisioned creating was an intimate one that kind of told the story of my personal evolution in music. And um, much of that occurred right alongside Darwin. So there was nobody else to ask but him. Um, yeah. Um, so hopefully after that first song, you're pumped up a little bit. Yeah, and uh, you're ready for another fun show. How about another round of applause for that Fred Cantu big band? <clears throat> so the last piece, uh, Don't You Worry About a Thing, is Stevie Wonder piece. And I was infatuated with Stevie Wonder since I was about three or four years old. My parents have pictures of me, I think, with like dark sunglasses on, like at a Casio keyboard, like pretending I'm Stevie Wonder, just like passionately singing, like I just called to say I love you. Um, and you know, his, his music really reaches grown-ups and kids alike, and he's my seven-year-old's new obsession. Um, but years later, I would have another obsession, and that is the music of Bobby McFerrin. Um, he would become another obsession of mine. So when I, I first, heard, first heard his masterwork album called Play that he did with Chick Corea, um, I was really compelled to push my limits and like study every little sound that Bobby McFerrin made. And so in college, I transcribed all of his solos from that album. Um, and it just made me really scared about everything in music. Like there's, no one could ever compare to Bobby McFerrin, his genius, he's, he's otherworldly. Um, and I thought hmm, maybe, the, maybe one day I'll be courageous enough to like sing one of my Bobby McFerrin transcriptions. Um, or, or dumb enough, or dumb enough. Um, well, today is the day. Uh, I'm gonna <laughs> uh, and so I'm glad I psyched myself out with Don't You Worry About a Thing because he sings things on this album that freak me out. Um, but you know, in my opinion, he's one of the greatest musicians of all time and um, I'd like to honor him. Um, so please enjoy our effort to honor Chuck Chick Rhea and Bobby McFerrin's um, gem. This is called Spain. Do 
Thank you. I think I'm done. Bye. See you later. <laughs> and there was a lot more that Bobby McFerrin did that I can't actually physically do because I'm not a man. Like he did a lot of low stuff. I just skipped it. Just skipped it. Um, anyway, thank you. <sighs> okay. So my, my time in college was spent in a practice room most of the daytime and most of, most of daytime hours and then uh, figuring out like my classical vocal technique and then at nighttime I would go gig around Bloomington, Indiana with my sub sub band. Um, so I had a really dual, dual existence in college. Um, so the next piece is a musical representation of that dual existence. This is an aria commonly known as La Banera from the opera Carmen. Um, it's really universally recognized uh, but today we've added a contemporary interpretation. Um, so Carmen, the temptress, she, uh, she's a provocative cig cigarette factory worker in Spain and she pro proclaims her philosophy of love to her co-workers and a crowd of admirers. And she compares love to this swift, rebellious bird that no one can domesticate and no one can tame. Es por mí buscando amor, como embrujada por una ilusión. Y si soy yo quien vas a ti, tendrás el beso de mi maldición. Mejor así, ay, no digas. 
digas que no te perdí Así será Si yo te amara Sería tu final El amor es siempre fugaz No hay que lo puedo tener Eres un canto a la libertad Y yo la canto igual que Por mí buscando amor, tome embrujada por una ilusión. Y si soy yo quien vas a ti, tendrás el beso de mi maldición. Mejor así, ay, no digas que no te perdí. Y si será, si yo te amara. Thank you. Thank you. So through divine intervention, about like one minute after I returned to Chicago after grad school in 2004, I was blessed to meet Darwin. And uh, we bonded over a really similar upbringing in music. So having a Latin music heritage, but then also going to, to music school for classical and jazz. And we especially connected over a Latin jazz album released that year that embodied the vision that I had for like my own dream album. So the choice of the repertoire, the blend of Latin and jazz and pop and R&B, and it was basically the album that I wished I had written. I had never really fully seen myself in the genre until I heard about um, Claudia Acuña's album, Luna, that was released again in 2004. It's really been a dream of mine to sing that whole album down. And so if you'll indulge me, we have two songs from that album to share with you tonight. The first one is called Oceano.
Thank you.
running parallel with my musical partnership with Darwin um, over these last 15 years was, has been my 15 year long teaching position at Northside College Prep. <laughs> all right, woo! A plus for you all. Um, so I've had the privilege of being the choral director there and the musical theater director and I, I have the gift of working with really passionate, ambitious wunderkinds, you know? Um, so I asked three of them to be here with me today and sing a song with me, is that cool? I'd like to welcome up Krista Cecil, Donovan Holt, and Samantha Ringer. It's really my attempt to um, honor how teaching music has really made me a better musician and um, showcase my wonderful students while simultaneous, simultaneously referencing my son's favorite band, Pentatonix. So this is, hold on, this is the Latin jazz version of Pentatonix's version of Katy Perry's song, Rise. Enjoy. I won't just survive Oh, you will see me thrive Can't write my story I'm beyond the archetype I won't just conform No matter how you shake my core Cause my roots, they run deep
So you see how I'm a lucky teacher, right? Um, woo, that's fun. Um, so when I performed uh, La Banera from Carmen earlier in the set, the Spanish lyrics at the end of the song came from a version that a really extremely gifted orchestrator named Alex Lacamoire created for an Afro-Cuban adaptation of Carmen called Carmen La Cubana. So if you don't recognize his name, it's pr almost certain that you've heard his music because he's the Cubano genius orchestrator of a little musical you might have called, uh, might have heard of called Hamilton. Uh, okay, so, but before Hamilton, Alex Lacamoire, um, alongside my son's current life inspiration, Lin-Manuel Miranda, um, who by the way is like such a source of pride, right? Like, don't we love him? Okay, um, together Alex and Lin-Manuel Miranda wrote a show called In the Heights. And um, that show is so important to me for so many reasons, because my musical theater loving sons, they celebrate their heritage in the car when they sing at the top of their lungs. And whenever I sing along, I feel musically most at home. It, it's music that embodies so many of my experiences in music, jazz, pop, R&B, hip hop, musical theater, all packaged neatly with like totally legit salsa, merengue, bomba plena, all, all of those influences are in there. So in the show, there's a character named Nina, and she's a student at Stanford. She's left school, um, fearing that she's not good enough to succeed, and while she's carrying the burden of being like the big success story of her barrio, um, she was the scholastic star of the neighborhood, and she's now lost, and she's unsure if she was ever deserving of going to Stanford, and it's, her place in the world is totally unclear. Um, so she came back to announce her decision to leave school to her parents, and the neighborhood piragua guy and the nosy neighbors are there to um, remind her over the next four minutes that she just needs to breathe. Street. I smile at the faces I've known all my life. They regard me with pride, and everyone's sweet. They say you're going places. So how can I say that while I was away, I had so much to hide? Hey guys, it's me, the biggest disappointment you know. The kid couldn't hack it, she's back. And she's walking real slow. Welcome home, just breathe.
straighten the spine, smile for the neighbors, everything's fine, everything's cool, the standard reply, lots of tests, lots of papers, smile, wave goodbye, and pray to the sky, oh God, then what will How about another hand for these kids? So, um, so there's this suave, good-looking, kind-hearted character named Benny, who's been, <laughs> who's been crushing on Nina uh, since they were kids. Um, and Benny drives home the idea that the community, and especially he, he could never be disappointed in her. In fact, he knows that he feels most at home when he's with her. They acknowledge their love, and Nina miraculously feels encouraged to keep her dreams alive, knowing that her neighborhood, and most importantly, the people in it, will always be her home. Tonight, I have the great pleasure of introducing you to the fabulous Stephen Allen, who played the role of Benny with Porchlight Theater Company back in 2016. Woo! Um, the song we have, uh, we will close the show with, and it really has a spirit that reflects the love that I have for Chicago, um, for the Latino and the music communities here, and for all of the people who made such a beautiful evening possible. I have had the greatest time with you all tonight, and actually, I am gonna need some audience participation on this one, all right? When I cue you, we're gonna practice, we're gonna practice. When I cue you, you have to say eight times in a row, eight times, you have to say, no pare, sigue, sigue, ready? So it's gonna be one, two, three, four, boom, no pare, sigue, sigue. Boom, no pare, sigue, sigue. Boom, no pare. Okay, good. You can do that eight times, right? Eight times. Now, I'm a choir director, so I'm going to give you the cue, but then when I cut you off, stop. I'm going to keep going because you're feeling it. The music has to do something else, okay? So cut it, stop when I cut you off. Okay, are you ready? Okay. So for our last piece of the evening, we bring you from In the Heights, When You're Home. used to think we lived at the top of the world and the world was just a subway map and the one slash nine climbed the dotted line to my place there's no nine train now oh right <laughs> i used to think the bronx was a place in the sky and the world was just a subway map And my thoughts took shape On that fire escape Can you remind me of what it was like At the top of the world Come with me July with the stop in my corner fire hydrant. You would open it every summer. I would bust it with the wrench till my face got drenched till I heard the sirens and then I ran like you hell. You ran like yeah, hell. I ran like I hell. Found the to well. your father's dispatch window. Hey, let me in, y'all. They're coming to get me. You were always in constant trouble. Then your dad would act the 
last night, but he let me hide. You be there inside. Life was easier then. And Nina, everything is easier when you're home. The street's a little kinder when you're home. Can't you see that the day seems clearer now that you are here, or is it me? Maybe it's just me. We gotta go, I wanna show you all I know The sun is setting and the lights are getting are low Are we going to Castle Garden? Maybe, maybe not, but way to take a shot When the day is hot, I got a perfect shady spot A little ways away that ought to cool us down cool us Welcome down. back to town Now back in high school when it darkened You'd hang up in Bennett Park And Usnavi would bring his radio Thank you so much. Please enjoy the rest of the festival. You have a wonderful band coming up after us. Uh, take a minute to recoup and then uh, get ready to dance. Thank you so much for having us this year.